Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's baby will not carry out full-time royal duties and be expected to work for a living. The new royal baby will be seventh in line for the throne, and will be behind Prince William's kids. Meghan Markle's baby is due in the spring, but is set to have a very different upcoming to cousins Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. The son or daughter of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will have to work for a living and will not carry out full-time royal duties. According to a royal commentator, royal expert Imogen Lloyd Webber said in the documentary When Kate Met William, A Tale of Two Lives, at the moment, Harry and Meghan are saying that they don't want a title for their baby. As a result, this baby is unlikely to ever have his or her royal highness prince or princess title and they will be expected to work for a living. This was backed up by royal commentator Victoria Murphy who said, There's no chance that this baby will ever be king or queen. This baby has so much more freedom than William and Kate's children do. She said they will not be expected when they get older to carry out full-time royal duties. The baby isn't the first royal to have to get a job for a living, as Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie have had to do the same. Victoria said this will give Meghan and Prince Harry's baby the chance to carve their own path. The royal newlyweds are said to want their first child to have what Harry has described as a relatively normal life according to a source close to the couple. The unnamed source, who spoke to The Times, added, that word normal looms very large for Harry and Meghan when it comes to their child's future. In the past Prince Harry, 34, has talked about the tricky balancing act of taking on a royal role while trying to retain a private life. Meanwhile, the children of Prince William and Kate Middleton will all be closer heirs to the throne. Currently the three sweet tots are third, fourth and fifth in line to the throne ahead of Prince Harry being sixth and his baby being seventh. Princess Charlotte became the first female royal to retain her claim to the throne, despite Prince William's third child being a boy. Before the succession to the Crown Act 2013 a son would leap over an older daughter in the line of succession.